I'm Rita Shelton Deverell, and I've been a broadcaster for about, oh, 30 years. At this moment, I am occupying Nancy's chair in women's studies at Mount St. Vincent University in Halifax until 2011. I think I became an actor member in Regina. So I started life as an actor. I was acting at the Globe Theater on their school tour, and many of us were hauled in to do CBC schools broadcast on radio, and I was one of the actors called in to do this. And of course, since it was a CBC radio gig, we had to be members of ACTRA, so I joined in the early 70s. I later fell into television, long story, but um, had a gig on CBC, uh, CBC's Take 30. Um, that went on for some time, various CBC shows, and then I became one of the people who applied for the license for Vision TV. So when Vision TV got licensed in 1989, we went on the air in 1990, by then I've been an ACTRA member for almost 20 years, and that's where my pension and retirement is. I realized, coming up to 2005, that I was also coming up to my 60th birthday. And I thought, okay, if I'm ever gonna get back to drama, how am I going to do that? I need to learn something new. I need to learn how to direct film and television drama. So I called up ACTRA in Winnipeg, and I said, I'm in this transition. What am I gonna do? And they said, have you ever thought about women in the director's chair? This was just a phone conversation. Now, I had recommended people for the program, but never thought of taking it myself. So I applied. I thought, they're going to say, since it had mid-career written all over it, that I was too old. I learned later, after they accepted me, that they accept usually at least two mature women who are in transition. And there is nothing more wonderful than if you've had other careers in media. So there are things you know about. You've been an editor. Uh, you've been, as in my case, um, an executive producer, a producer, producing lots of shows, high volume shows. Uh, you're accustomed to dealing with budgets. So all you have to learn is how to direct and how to work with actors. It's a wonderful program. What happens is you have approximately three months to do nothing but your art with all of the people that you need to do that. And the unions, for the most part, contribute those people. Uh, it's an amazing growth experience. I can't say enough good things about women in the director's chair, and I am on the board of directors now, and I'm proud to be on the board.